Hello, Crazy Food Lady here, and um, it's December 12th, I think, maybe, somewhere around there. Maybe it's the 11th. And um, I thought I was done making jam and canning for the year, but I was wrong. I found a recipe for a jam that goes by a variety of different names. Um, let's see, Winter's Delight. Christmas jam, Amish Christmas jam, um, and it is a jam that includes cranberries, strawberries, oranges, and orange zest. Um, given the ingredients that it calls for, um, there's no way that this is a traditional Amish jam because um, not using electricity means that you're not going to be able to have strawberries frozen or fresh. Um, available to you at the same time as cranberries because cranberries are late um, they're a fall um, item and strawberries are early um, in the year spring um, and they do not last um, I suppose it's possible you could make this in the summer with cranberries that you've held over because they do um, last pretty well but they kind of dry up and shrivel I think so anyway, um, I am suspicious about the origins <laughs> of this jam. But anyway, um, I saw it and I thought, oh, that looks really good. And boy, wouldn't that be cool to make and then give to people. So that's what we're going to do. We got cranberries. Yay, and seasoned cranberries. Um, I'm going to use these little tiny oranges because um, they're a little bit older and need to be used. They're not like old and about to go bad or anything like that. Um, they're cuties. Um, and I'm going to use strawberries. I have some frozen strawberries, but I want to use those in um, the spring when I do some raspberry and um, rhubarb jams that uh, with stuff that I've got in the freezer. So I'm saving that. Um, oh, and then there's some spices. So I've got to measure those out. So that's what we're going to do. And um, because this is a small batch, because um, that was the agreement, um, <laughs> we have so much jam, there was really not a need for more. So I'm making a small batch. It's gonna be done in the kitchen entirely using the tiny wee canner. 